Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to Goal Line Hockey. It's your boy Kevin Forte. And guys, we have something very special. I've been off for the past couple of days. I apologize for that as always, but I have some good news. We have a jersey unboxing. Another reverse retro jersey has been purchased by Kevin Forte. We're going to be taking a look at that in this video. If you guys like what we're doing here at Gold Line Hockey, want to see the latest news around the NHL, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and an even bigger subscribe down below. Let's take a look at this new uni. All right, guys, so welcome back to Goal Line Hockey. I know it's been a couple of days. I apologize for that, but we are back, and I am excited. I'm more excited than ever, especially because we have a new jersey to unbox. And, guys, let's get right into it. So, as you guys know, the past couple of reverse retros I have, I have the Anaheim Ducks Mighty Wing reverse retro. I have... The, I'm looking in the closet now, the Tampa Bay Lightnings, reverse retro, and I have the Buffalo Sabres, reverse retro. I have three reverse retros right now, and we can now add a fourth to that list. Now, I don't want to give away too many spoilers. I want you guys just to see it for yourself, and this is my first time looking at it. I have the package right here, and I actually have another jersey, which is kind of important to this jersey as well. Uh, so you'll understand more when I open the jersey. So that's package right here. Got the big boy. Yep, that's definitely the logo. The logo is very hard to uh, to miss. Let's just say that. And this is my first jersey. I wanted to get it in the new look. And uh, I think some of you already out there know what it is. There it is, baby. The Ottawa Senators. Reverse retro wow this is a nice freaking jersey and a lot of you guys ask me in the comment section what size uh usually size 46 i wear small uh but because you know the shoulders have been getting a little bit bigger uh, i do get size 50 as well it depends on what they have in stock really at the end of the day ideally i get 46 or 50 if it's a jersey i know i'm not going to be able to get i will pick up a size 52 but more than likely 46 or 50 it just depends on how I feel that day. So here we go. Right there. Wow. Now, I know what they're talking about now with that gold shimmer. That is that is a beauty. Wow. And a very basic collar. I do like that. The patches aren't... Um, yeah, the patches are a little disappointing. They aren't the real patch. Um... That's a little disappointing, but other than that, you got 1992, which was, I believe, when they came back to Ottawa. So you got that on the inside of the collar. You got the shoulder patch. Not too bad. I'm not going to lie. I'm not too bad. I do like it. And obviously, there you go. So you got the black, the two black stripes on the sleeves. And one black, big black stripe down the bottom. Wow. Not too bad. All right, guys. Here's a fair warning. Uh, you're going to see my hair right now. So let's do that. Wow. So this is a nice jersey. I have to admit, I, I kind of like it. I kind of like it right now. Jesus, my hair is crazy, though. So I know a bunch of you comment section knew that I was looking at the new Senators jerseys and uh, there was a little bit of an issue I wanted to buy it when I first bought Tampa and Anaheim I actually wasn't going to I, going into that I was not planning on buying Tampa at that point I thought I, I would buy Tampa's later on but Ottawa's reverse retros were already selling out so I had to pick it up the second I saw it on I believe it was any the NHL shop I picked this up. It actually looks like a tiger, the tiger jersey. It looks very orange in the uh, in the picture frame, but I I freaking like this. Now the reason I said earlier in the video, why do you what you were talking about another jersey? Yes, this is the old sense jersey, guys. The Reebok, the old edition. The old is new again. The Sens go back to their old logo or an updated version of the old logo compared to this. 
Now, I know a lot of people don't like this logo, but a lot of people actually really like this logo, which honestly, I kind of like it as well. It's definitely different, uh, but I hate to admit, now that I've got this jersey, I kind of like the new, the new old logo better. I, I hate to say it. And the fact that they didn't do a, a lot of winning, especially... You know, once they lost Carlson and Hoffman and all that stuff that went down, it was probably needed that they they, did, they needed a redevelopment of the team. Uh, so it makes sense. You have the O's on the shoulders, um, which that, I don't know what's going on with that, but now we go back to the, the little S emblem. They don't have, they got, they ditched the white under the sleeves and the all the black. They just changed it up. I, I think this is a lot better looking, honestly. Uh, this jersey... It's officially been uh, retired slash updated in my collection. Uh, so I'm going to still wear this jersey, absolutely. Um, and I got it for really cheap. Kind of remind, it's going to always be a reminder of Eugene Melnick and the absolute chaos that went down in Ottawa. So I'm definitely going to keep that jersey. And with the way the Senators are playing right now, in the worst way, I needed to send a new Sens jersey because I'm going to probably be wearing the Sens a lot, especially when I talk about the prospects over the next couple months because that's what the senators are probably going to be looking at the next couple months so uh yeah definitely a, a disappointing uh season right now for the senators but to lighten it up i did get a new sense jersey with the new logo i really did like the red jersey the most i heard the rumors that the black and the white jerseys did not have a gold uh a little bit of gold on the actual logo so that kind of took me away from that uh I am still considering getting those jerseys at some point. My plan was to get the red and the white at the same time, but it just didn't work out. I'm having issues with, you know, money. Let's put it that way. These are not cheap. Uh, so I was only able to pick up one jersey this month. And I honestly, it was one of those things where I knew I wanted this jersey, but you have to wait for the right time to get it. And I was able to find the right deal at the right time on NHL. These jerseys are not going to be there that long, so I knew I had to pick it up uh, because I was going to regret it. If I saw it there and I didn't pick it up, I would have been really disappointed. Uh, you know, potentially during the summer. That's probably going to be the next time I open up jerseys. I'll probably do a jersey Christmas over the summer, uh, and that'll probably be the next time I buy jerseys, guys. But in the meantime, I hope you guys like this video. If I have to give this jersey a rating based off of me wearing it now and stuff like that, I'd have to give it... I think it would look better with numbers, but I have to give it like an 8 out of a 10. Uh, I really like the red. The faux red I think looks good. They, that's one part of the old jersey that I think they did the right job of. The collar, basic collar. Uh, honestly, I don't know if I like the red right here uh, and then the black. I think it should have been just a straight black collar. I don't really like that little bit of red. I'm a little disappointed the shoulders are just... They're not actual patches like the Buffalo Sabres one that I have or the Lightning jersey I think is patched on as well. So that's a little bit disappointing. Uh, I think this jersey would definitely look better with numbers. Maybe that's something I take a look at in the future, but I do have the jersey for now, so I'm more than happy about that. Like I said, 8 out of 10. The logo really does it for me. I love the red jersey in general. Uh, it's just a clean look. Nothing too crazy, and honestly, those are some of the best jerseys overall. So guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. What do you think of the Ottawa Senators reverse retro jerseys? And for that matter, what do you think of the other Ottawa Senators jerseys in general? Do you like them? Do you like the new logo, the new jerseys? And also, let me know in the comment section which reverse retro jerseys did you pick up this year. Guys, thank you so much for watching, and let's go Sens, because we know they need it right now.